Hey guys, it's Nate. I have something I want to share with you guys. As you guys know, I've been vegan for almost a decade now. You know, I've been a normal vegan. I've been an alkaline vegan, a raw vegan. I've done all different types of vegan diets. But um, yeah, man, I feel like it's not working for me. So um, I will thought I would document the first meal I'm going to have in almost 10 years of me not eating no meat or fish. So here we have some pork chops. We have some tuna sashimi. We have some scallops, which one of them burnt a little bit. And here we have some fried chicken. Yeah, man, these are the foods that I missed that I haven't had in a long time. Don't even know what to tuck into first, but yeah, I guess I'm gonna go with a fried chicken, right? I don't need the need. I'm a bit scared, bro. All right, cool, let me take a bite. What have I been missing? Oh my days. I need another bite of that. Alright. Let's tuck into this tuna sashimi. I'm worried about this one, you know. But yeah, actually, first, let me go for the scallop. Let me go for the scallop first. Oh, yeah, the scallops are so good. Mm. Yeah, I need a bit more tuna sashimi as well. Last but not least, let's dig into this pork fillet. Mm. Mm. Guys, it's officially over. It's officially over, guys. The vegan journey, it's officially over. The clowning is officially over. Happy April Fool, suckers. Do you think I would eat a living being? You're crazy. Damn, let me show you these guys what's up. Here we have some watermelon, yeah? As you guys can see, come up close. Seeds in there and everything. I ain't eating no living flesh ever. I'm vegan for life. And here, the scallops. The trumpet mushroom royales. The pork fillet. As you can see, it's light green mushroom. And the chicken is oyster mushroom. Dipped in spelt flour and then fried. Remember guys, you don't need to eat living beings to taste good food. Have a good one.